So anybody have a mentor or a hero? Raise your hand if you have somebody in dentistry you really respect. Yes, somebody you look up to, somebody you really respect. Excellent. I respect this young man. So this is Dr. Jeff Berger. His front desk person brought me in to work with them. And when I arrived, I can't tell who's the front desk. I can't um, tell what the roles are. Everybody got to choose not only their own attire, they got to choose their own business cards. So everybody had a different looking business card. Yes. And so when I, I met with him, I asked him, I said, Jeff, Jeff, what are your goals? And he said, my goals are that people would respect me. My brother is older and he's a dentist here and my dad's a dentist here and I'm just little Jeff, baby Jeff. And I said, okay, so here's the deal. How willing are you to work? He said, I want to get better, I'll work. I said, okay. So eventually, of course, everybody had uniforms that looked like they were the same and Jeff actually learned a lot, became very successful, enough to be on the cover and recognized by the Progressive Dentist Magazine. So before and after and some years have gone by. But here's the reason I respect Jeff so much. I introduced Jeff to CrossFit, and he's there getting some training and coaching from a CrossFit Games athlete. Okay, yes, she's my daughter, but yes, okay. <laughs> he traveled, spent three days with her to get coaching on it because he wanted to get better. So when we had the Games recently, we had the Open, Jeff scored really, really well, not just in the state of California, but in the United States. And I asked him, I said, Jeff, Jeff, I didn't know you were so naturally athletic. What were the things that you did in high school? What were the sports you did in high school? And he said, I tried them all, but I, I was always on the bench. I was always on the bench as a freshman. Maybe I was on the bench as a sophomore, but I always told myself, I'm going to be quiet, I'm going to work hard, and I'll get better. The skills and the things that I'm going to ask and suggest you do won't happen unless you do the work. They won't happen just because they're a good idea. They only happen when you implement them.